yeah in the part of ias um first of all i uh, everyone familiar familiar with uh, most of the fil- people familiar with oracle database so and it's a fresh topic just i want to go with the salesforce account uh say salesforce connection later we will uh, discuss about oracle oracle database uh, just for uh, f- some feel good freshness that's why i am creating some salesforce account connector let's see first of all uh, to connect say a salesforce ac- a connector um, first we have to create a salesforce account so uh, in google search salesforce developer and go to uh, developer edition sign up we have to create an account create job role developer any company can give india username you can give anything then password and In this way, we have to create a Salesforce account. Yeah, uh, it will send one email. Salesforce uh, Salesforce team will send one email. This welcome to Salesforce. Yeah, we need to verify our account. Yeah, in this way you have to create password. Yeah, in this way. In this way, you can create. sales for account sales sales for account thank you later we will we will see the connections and all how to give the connections let's see later yeah let's create a sales for connection we already uh, we already create a sales for account uh, now let's create sales for account before that just go to add on connections and add on connections check for salesforce can find salesforce so many app oh yeah salesforce connector uh, start free trial 
Yeah, okay. So this was connected trial initiated successfully. You should be able to run task using this connector in less than thirty in less than thirty minutes. Okay. Now go to uh, connections. Create. Salesforce, Salesforce connection. Here, Salesforce. Uh, we added uh, free trial version. That's why it here showing. If you did not add free trial version there, it will not show here. Runtime environment. Salesforce standard. Click on standard. Username, password. can check in your mail this is username Wha what is the username you given while creating that name you have to create and give password we already it is automatically taking security token you have to take from our uh, this account sales for account go to salesforce view profile uh, and go to switch to sales classic salesforce let's go to classic salesforce for some visually it will comfort comfortable later here click on sales it is already in sales now go to like in our profile my settings it, it might change a website every every uh, for a few months few days a uh, website get update uh, but so I have to check for the settings my profile my settings later in my settings go to personal in personal reset my security token click on reset my security token after registration, you can't use your wallet token in every settings. Yeah, it will send one token to our mail. Go to our mail, refresh. Yeah, this is the security token. copy paste here test connection let's see to check for sales full server is running or not yeah uh, after uh, after we install free uh, start free trial account uh, that that server will get update here in run environment server will get update so uh, 67.0.2 in previously 0 0.1 will be there here 2 will come after uh, added that server free trial version of sales for now let's check whether it is connected or not connections go to connections salesforce edit edit test connection test connection why it is loading yeah what is that invalid username username what is that lanka suryam yeah not suryam it's yan suryan again give password now test connection yeah 
yeah test for this connection was successful successfully salesforce connection was activated uh, let's see uh, later in later video how to move data from uh, how to create mapping and all i'm stopping this session here with sales for account connection that's it